What's going on YouTube? This is Long Lever bringing you a flashlight review today. Of course, this will not be a full review. This is just an unboxing and first impressions. So let's go ahead and open her up using the Kershaw knife today. Again, one of my most favorite knives. Open this up. And we have this, the BYB light. Um, it is a Cree flashlight. It's got five modes, waterproof, and 18650 battery capable. Comes in at $40. So let's go ahead and open it up. We'll take a look at it. It's supposed to be 1200 lumens. It's got a, uh, or never mind, I lied, it's 26650 batteries. I don't even know what those are. I've never even seen those before. So we will see. Holy cow. Look at these lights. These flashlights. So user manual, that stuff, whatever. Battery recharger. Comes with a solar powered flashlight. Little mini torch. That's interesting. This company was nice enough to send me this for free to do a review. So it's got a little solar panel on the back. Huh, it's a little flashlight. That's awesome. From BYB Light. That's cool. I had no idea that was going to be in there. Um, that actually looks like it is a... Is that a converter? It is a converter for 18650. So I almost didn't lie. And my battery's charging right now. But that it comes with a converter, so you can put two 18650 batteries in here. Because these things I have never seen before. I've never even heard of these. 26650 batteries. These things look like they're the width of a C battery and the length of a D battery. Uh, it comes with a little lanyard, adjustable strap. And this is the flashlight itself. So, like it says in the box, it's supposed to be 1,200 lumens. Runs off of two 26650 batteries or an 18650 battery adapter. That's what I read that I thought it was 18650s. Uh, made out of high-quality aluminum. Completely machined. And it looks to be a pretty solid flashlight. Uh, for size dimensions... Comes in at 1.7 pounds with the batteries inside of it, 9.1 inches long, 2.2 inches wide, and looks like to be about 6.6 .6 inches, 6.3 inches in radius. So the outside diameter, if you wrap a tape measure around it, would be 6 inches. Battery power, 3.7 volts, 10 watts, blah, blah, blah. Let's go ahead and power it up, see what's up. Go ahead and open her up. Seems like it would be a very solid flashlight. Maybe this way. Looks like it runs off of a single one of these batteries. Yep, one of these batteries will power it. So you have an extra one that can be charging while you're using this one. All right, so there's the first one. I'm gonna guess it's low. Nope, that was high. That looks like SOS. All right, so there's high. You can also go down to a spotlight with that strange square Cree LED, where you can blow it out. There's medium and low. I do not, unfortunately, have lumen specifications with these. They did not say it in their description, and it does not. Uh, I could not find any information on it. But it's got strobe. And then it looks like it has SOS as the five modes. So medium, high, medium, low, strobe, and SOS. Um, high looks to be right at 1,000 lumens, about normal. Looks like about 1,000 compared to what I've seen. And medium, I'm going to guess, is probably five, 600. And then low is probably 100, somewhere in there. That's my guesstimation. I do not know. But seems like a very solid, uh, solid flashlight. I, of course, will do some more testing, and a full review will be down below. I'm also going to see if they will send a coupon code to get you guys uh, some money off of this flashlight. Right now, it runs at $40. $40 actually seems a little bit high to me, 
but we will see as we test it. Maybe it is a rock solid flashlight that is absolutely amazing and will be worth the price. So thank you for watching. That was the BYB light unboxing. Keep in mind, there will be a full review coming up within the next couple of weeks. So keep an eye out for that. So thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day.